Hey guys, um, I am doing my makeup collection video today also. These products have came from Dollar Tree, Icing by Claire's, Ulta, and Mary Kay, um, my mom's a Mary Kay consultant, so some of this has came from Mary Kay too. So let's get into it. Um, first thing I will be showing you is this L'Oreal Makeup Designer Paris La Palette Nude 1. It's a very pretty nude colors. My sister actually gave that to me. This is a make makeup collection video. My sister gave that to me. And then this Ulta Eyeshadow Palette. This Pro Fusion Natural Palette. It's all nude colors. And then my last um, big eyeshadow palette is this NYX Dreamy Catcher Palette. Dream Catcher Palette. And then it's in the shade. Um, these. Um, this palette is called Dusk Till Dawn. Down to the Dollar Tree eyeshadows I got um, in my first haul of part two. These LA Colors 3 Color Eyeshadow Palette. I got two of these in Iris. Two of these, same thing, but um, the color Sunflower. And then the last LA Color Street Color Eyeshadow Palette in the color Water Lily. Um, this was also given to me. It is also a L'Oreal Paris um, Colorage Eyeshadow Palette in the color Stacked Heels. Now for my single eyeshadows. This Milani Eyeshadow in Bella Violet. So, I'm doing all five of my Milani eyeshadows right now. One in Bella Fuchsia. Bella Pink. Bella Teal. Bella Rose. And guys, if you want me to do makeup swatches of these, I will. Um, I will do a separate video just for that. So... Um, just a comment down below if I get a bunch of requests for that I will do it but if I don't then I'm not going to and then this one didn't come from Dollar Tree I got this from Ulta it's a NYX single eyeshadow in Mermaid Sirene and then the last two eyeshadows I got from Dollar Tree I got two of these Wet n Wild um, Color Icon single eyeshadows in Cheeky so I got two of those and then I do have a few more eyeshadows, but they are in this compact. These three small ones right here are the eyeshadows, and that is actually a blush. So next category would be doing blushes. Um, this is a Mary Kay blush, and these are Mary Kay eyeshadows and a Mary Kay compact. And then I've got these two e.l.f. blushes. Um... One is in Fuchsia Fusion, and it is a pretty shimmery pink. And then the other one is in Pink Passion. It is a radiant pink. Then the last two blushes I will be doing are by Icing. I got from Icing by Claire's on my 18th birthday last year. Um, this one doesn't have the color, but these are baked blushes. It's a pretty shimmery gold color. So, that one looks more like a highlighter when you put it on than it would a blush, but it is a baked bronzer. And this is a baked blush. It's a pretty um, pink color. 
like a peachy pink color. And down to the foundations. Um, this one I did get from Big Lots. It's the CoverGirl Nature Luxe Liquid Silk Foundation in 335 Dune. This Mary Kay Luminous Wear Liquid Foundation in Beige 1. And last but not least, these are too dark for my skin, so I probably will be giving these away. Um, all they've been used. I only used them a tiny bit, though. I only used this one. But this, the LA Colors Liquid Makeup um, Foundation, Liquid Foundation, and the color Tan. And that is it for my liquid foundations. Now for my regular foundation is this LA Colors Pressed Powder in the color Nude. Got three of those. This um, powder foundation, it's a mineral powder foundation in Ivory 2. And then this one is a cream to powder foundation. That last one's by Mary Kay, and this one is also. It is a endless performance cream to powder foundation in beige one. Now for the BB creams, I only have two brands of BB creams, but I do have two of each. Um, this icing BB cream, it brightens, refreshes, and conceals, and it's a light medium. got two of those and then I've got the Sashi and Chic BB Cream. It's the multi-action skincare and makeup. And then for my makeup primer, my mom actually gave this to me and I've used a great bit of it as you see. It's the Spackle Color Correcting Under Makeup Primer and it's a neutralizing primer. And it's by Laura Geller Beauty into an Ingenuity. It says apply a thin layer over a clean moisturized face. It's oil free and paraben free. Primer co color corrects uneven skin tone, neutralizes the color look of imperfections. Wear under the foundation for perfect ap makeup application or use for a flawless looking complexion. And this is made in the USA. And um, the, it was distributed by Laura Geller Beauty, LLC, New York City, New York. So that was my makeup primer. Now, the last thing I have is my mascaras. I don't feel like going back over there and get my eyeliners, so I will be doing a part two just to show my eyeliners and my brow pencils. Um... One thing I do have on me is my brow powder back in leak, which I will be showing last in this video. This is the LA Colors HD Waterproof Mascara. The L'Oreal Paris Water Voluminous Hydrofudge Waterproof Mascara. Then I have three of these Wet n Wild Mega Wear Mascaras that I got from Dollar Tree. And then the last mascaras I got are these bold uh, LA Colors Bold Lash Mascaras that I got from Dollar Tree. Well guys, that is it for this Makeup Collection Part 1 video. Hope you have a good night's sleep. Don't forget, we love you. And don't forget to keep my family in your prayers um, for my grandpa pa passing. Well, that is it for this video, guys. And don't forget to subscribe below. Like my videos and comment down below. Bye.